Welcome to Structure Deck Shuffle. Each week, MBT and I will open random structure decks in 15 of their corresponding secret packs before playing a match to determine the winner. Tune in every Saturday for new episodes of the Structure Deck Shuffle. Okay, go ahead, go oh, ahead. I, I think I think it's what I got. I think it's what I got. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Are you? F <laughs> Get that guy back there, please. No, I don't need another turn. I don't need another turn. I got uh, Blackwing Gores. I got yeah, Blackwing like, Goddess of Sweet you, Revenge. Dog, I don't hand. think another turn is going to do anything. Yeah, you know, it might, though. It could. <laughs> oh, I didn't think about it that way. <laughs> this was a great episode. Welcome back to another episode of Shuffling Structure Decks. We are Shuffling Structure Decks. MBT got it last week, so here is his spin. And do not forget, we do have respinnies in this show, so he does not have to keep this spin necessarily. You have oh, gotten- Oh, I'm not recording. Oh, you're not recording? Hello, everybody. Hi, it's me, Joseph. What did I roll? <laughs> Zombie! Now, make sure you, you wanna, carefully you wanna, look you at wanna... this structure deck. I want you to make sure okay, you've wait, looked on. at it before taking this one. I mean, it doesn't look that bad, but it is missing a few... Honestly, you know what? It doesn't look that terrible, but it is missing a few oh, key I'm, cards. I'm noticing there's no Eldritch the Golden Lord, so why would I play this? No um, Doom King Baldurak either. That's kind of the big one. Wait, what the hell? Why is there no Baylor Drock? That's so screwed up. What do they want me to summon with Glow Up Bloom? Jack of Boolin? That's probably what they want. And Red Ogre. This deck is really good and has a lot of cool tools. But the payoff really is summon Skeletal Dragon Felgrand Pass. Yeah. Koakimiro Ghoulin Galate is in here too. So that could be your boss monster. I will take it. Take it. Okay. Take it. I mean, I think it could get a lot better with a couple good pulls. Let's see what I got today. Let's see what we're rolling with. Are we going to get lucky? Um... Ooh, Cyber Dragon. Let me check how many Cyber Darks are in this structure deck before. Oh, they all are. In um, fact, it is a majority Cyber Dark structure. I'm very. I will. I will just tell you. I'm very partial to this structure deck. I think it's quite good. Yeah, I mean, it looks like it has a lot of good stuff. Yeah, I think I will need to pull a few things, but it does give you most of the tools to build this deck. I'll take Cyber Dragon. Uh, good luck with those pulls. So here's what Doug doesn't know. This actually has two associated packs. Uh, Abyssal Glory, which is like uh, the white cards alongside Baylor Drock and uh, Zombie World, and also Fires of This World and Next, which is like Shiranui Mayakashi, and regrettably I have an Ultra Rare available for my time in uh, Master Roulette. But this set sucks, Fires of This World and Next. Um, it's not very good at all. Uh, so I will be going into uh, the Abyssal Underworld. This deck is already okay. You can see it's got a lot of pretty good stuff in it already. The Yuna Zombie is a big deal. It's got Necroworld Banshee. It's got Zombie World. It's got Jackabolan, Al Ghul Mazera, Changshi the Spirit Owl, Mad Mauler, Plague Spreader. It just doesn't really have payoffs. So all we need from this set is one good UR. Uh, that can be Doom King Baylor Drock, but it can also be enough Revenge Reds that we play them. It could theoretically be King of the Skull Servants. Uh, even white princess uh, makes the zombie monsters a little more sticky so uh let's grab 10 and see where we end up i mean that's two two ultras that's uh that's really good news okay one two three four five six seven eight well there's revenge red origins i think it's maybe possible that what we want to do is go in on that strategy Ugh, out of the pack whatever Revenants is important. Slayer is important. Assault Synchron. Oh my God, we're probably gonna play that. All right, here we go. Pack, 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 that's good. Happy to see that. And uh, also very strong. Very strong. Not Baylor Drock, though. Notably not Baylor Drock. Out of the pack. Um, Pain Painter is something. Ooh, Firewall Dragon Gender Fluid. Happy Pride, everybody. I, is this going up? Yeah, this is going up while Pride is still live. Happy Pride, everybody. Uh, okay, whatever. Okay, here we go. Pack a 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 p
the pack. It's in the pack. Okay, here we go. Huh? Oh, damn it. Oh, damn it! That's nice. That's a beautiful card. Whoop. Sure. Uh, painful decision, I think, is not going to come up. Now, two packs left. I really, really want that Baylor Drock. We've already pulled so many URs. Can we really be more greedy? It looks like we might be playing Revenge Red, uh, at least as an engine. Okay. Tinda Angle. Here it is. Oh, Battle Lord. Yeah, okay, we probably will be playing Vendred, at least in some capacity. Can we end on a hollow, etc.? Okay, nothing in the first four, that's good. Although we probably will play Spherk. Another Battle Lord is nice. And the third Battle Lord. Holy moly! The Battle Lord playset? Alright, we'll take that. All right, I think the structure deck looks pretty good. We have a lot of Cyber Dragon cards in here. It already gives you two Cyber Dragons, which is great. And this deck has a lot of really powerful OTK tools such as Power Bond and uh, Overload Fusion. Now the new Cyber Dark cards are actually really good. You know, we do have access to Cannon Claw as well as Chimera. And if we can turbo out to the uh, big 5,000 attack monster on turn one with the Chimera combo, then that would obviously be very strong. Now I'm not sure what we're going to open in our pulls today, but there are a lot of Cyber Dragon cards that I would love to have two copies of, including the uh, Cybernetic Overflow, which is an insanely powerful card in Sealed. Let's get to the packs, though, and see what we got. All right, here we go. Pearlescent Cyber Dragons, as well as the Cyber Dark cards. We get one free pack. I'll count it in my five, though. Do not worry. Let's see what we have. A lot of good cards to pull. We got Hearse. We got Keel, we got Horn. Um, yeah, the low rarity Cyber Dark cards, the like old ones, are not really ideal. Usually in the actual Cyber Dragon deck, uh, when people were kind of trying it out, they only played like one copy of each of them anyway. But, um, you know, maybe we could pull them. Sprite Carrot, um, actually not bad. I think we could theoretically use that. Keep going. And uh, yes, my goal is to piss off all of the German viewers today because I know that I will not pronounce any of these cards correctly such as Cyber Dragon Nashter. Is that close? Am I close? Maybe. The Cyber Dark cards are very good at controlling the field, but we are missing some of the important pieces like Elder Entity Natis, which is one of the big reasons to uh, play them. Oh, we got Mega Fleet, we got Chimera Tech. Unfortunately, not really relevant in this matchup. And one thing that I did want to mention here is that I don't know how many packs we've opened. Zombie World is low-key, maybe high-key, very good against a machine deck like this one. So I am a little bit worried about that. Another Power Bond, Cyberload Fusion could be good. I think we are trying to set up some sort of OTK in this episode, so hopefully we pull enough of those Fusion cards. And of course, like any series, we do have access to three copies of the regular Palmerization. Although this deck honestly has so many like of its own Palmerizations that maybe you don't even need to play those. All right, let's get those last five packs. Uh, really just hoping for Baylor Drock here. Speaking of... Ah, out of the pack. What the fuck? We might actually play this. Okay, next up. Yuck. Hound Horde's big. That's important. Quacky Ducky! Nope. Nothing. Snore. Come on. Give me Baylor Drock. Can I please just have Baylor Drock? Haven't I been a good enough boy? No. Clearly not. Tragoedia. We might play that. All right, last pack. Here we go. Nah, nothing. All right, looks like we're going to have to do this uh, Baylor daddy list, but that's okay. Oh? I'll take another Banshee. Okay, let's build this deck. All right, 10 packs. Here we go. Show me... Okay, okay. I don't know. I feel like we're already in a pretty good spot. We could use more of the Cyberdark cards. Um, hopefully, the Cyberdark Tenki is in this pack. Vampire Sucker, he probably wants that card, but uh, we got it. Cybernetic Overflow, is that our second or third copy? Not entirely sure, but either way, good pickup. Nine Lives Cat, okay. Uh, Cyber Dragon Dre, we got our first Nova. Is that really not in the structure deck? That seems really strange. 
Does that mean Infinity isn't in there either? So we're really trying to look for Nova Infinity, I guess, to make our deck a lot better. Dre, we got Rev System. Altergeist, man, remember Altergeist? Good times, good times. You guys ever try to play that deck on Master Duel these days with all the new support? It's like once every 20 games, you get a huge combo with seven interactions, and then the other nine games, the other 19 games, I should say, you just break and die. Sprite Pixies to go with our Sprite Carrot. Um, I don't know. Are there level twos in this deck? Uh, maybe. Oh, shit. This is actually uh, pretty good. <laughs> this can, uh, I guess it can't make Nova, right? Nova's machines only. Maybe if we pull another rank five. Holy shit. Three supers outside the pack, though. Terrible. Really good. Holy shit. We pulled Cyber Twin Dragon outside the pack. <laughs> Scrap Iron Scarecrow, though. That's a pretty big pickup. I like that one. Do you guys remember, and maybe you didn't do this, but in elementary school, we all thought that you could activate the Scrap Iron Scarecrow over and over and over again in the same turn. And uh, that card was overpowered. It just said your opponent cannot attack. Geonator Transverser. Oh, shit. That's going to catch him off guard. Who plays around Transverser in this form? One last shout out to uh, Pride Month, right? We're still in June. Puppet Parade. Power Bond. Honestly, I think we're kind of popping off here. Other than Infinity, I feel like we've gotten a lot of cards. Now, I will say we've missed all of the Cyber Dark cards, so I'm not really sure. Okay, well, let's look at this last pack. Okay, how many fucking Cyber Twin Dragons do we have? Like six of them? Kind of fucked up. Like, how many did we pull? We pulled three of them. Great. Just what I needed. Um, Honestly, not really a good 10 packs in terms of high rarity cards, but I think that Cyber Dragons have a lot of good low rarity cards. So let's make the deck and see what it looks like. So here's the list we ended up with. I'm not thrilled about it. Lack of Baylor Daddy means that it's a little bit unfocused, but I still feel okay. And that's because we pulled a pretty expansive Vendred lineup. You can see we've got three Battle Lord, one copy of Slayer. Our main deck monsters are a little lacking. One Hound Horde, two Revenants. But we have three copies of Charge, which should make them pretty easy to find alongside a Vendred Knights as well. Outside of that, we've just got a lot of uh, enablers like Unizombies, uh, Jackabulins, uh, Changshi the Spirit Out to get into Al Ghul Mazeral. I'm hoping that it's okay, um, but if Doug's deck is a little more focused, I could see us getting absolutely walloped. Here's hoping. All right, here's the deck. It looks really good, I think. It has strong OTK potential, and I think it also has a lot of just individually powerful cards. We are playing a small Cyber Dark engine because we didn't really pull a lot of those cards, but I think it is worth just playing a couple because Cyber Dark Chimera searches Power Bond, which is obviously one of our main win conditions. That being said, we did miss out on a couple cards you know, we only have one core, only one cyber emergency, but I think we got enough three ofs of the low rarity cards to have a pretty good chance today. Let's jump into the duels though and see how it goes. All right, so I know this isn't a character roulette. Right. So we don't necessarily have to do voices, but can you give me an, an epic cyber voice and I'll give you an epic zombie voice? Epic Cyber Void. Beep boop, beep boop. That's pretty good. I like that a lot. Yeah. Should I pull out my white baking costume from the closet? <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, during Ooh, Pride? Good. All right, what are we? Ooh, this, this deck is not <laughs> very good. All right, go ahead. Okay, okay. Um, yeah. Let's see what I got here. Perfect. Um... Okay, okay, sure, sure. Okay, I'm gonna activate Fusion Deployment, which is just in this deck for some reason. And here we get Albaz, and then we, uh... Yeah, oh, okay. yeah. I just happened to pull, you know, a couple of those cards. Cyber Emergency. Yup. To add... Do you know how to pronounce these cards? You know, you seem to be a German expert, so I thought I would ask. Uh, yes, I do. Uh, this is Cyber Dragon Nox. Er. <laughs> yeah, yeah, th that sounds about right. Um, okay, let's add this. Oh, there's only one target. Perfect. Add one in Cyber Dragon. Okay, sure. Let's try for Power Bond. Uh, well, that's Power Bond, all right. Oh, I, I guess I could do this. About it. Okay, this seems a little risky, but I think it could just be really funny. Let's use all three of these monsters to summon 8,000 oh. attack point 
sight. This has an animation. Oh my god. And then I'll Am summon dead? Cyber Dark Edge. Oh my god. Attack. I'm not. Oh no! What? Bro. No. <laughs> no, not like that, uh, man. <laughs> okay, what the hell are we I doing did here? decide um, the other day I was thinking about it because so many people, myself included, think that Power Bond like destroys a monster. I think there's just like this Mandela effect where people combine and mix around the limiter removal and the Power Bond restrictions. Mm -hmm. I think that's what's happening here because they both double the attack, so it makes sense. And he stays at 8,000 permanently. Yes. See, that's the other thing that people forget about. It's just like they're very similar cards played in similar decks and yet so different. Okay. Um, I am going to normal summon Nine-Tailed Fox. Oh, okay. A ninja legend! It is. And then we're going to use Plagues here. Mm-hmm. I mean, that seems Check pretty this good. card seem a little better if I had more to do with it. Instead, we're just going to make Zombie Knight Skeleton Felgrand. I think these cards are okay. What does this one do? Well, it has 2,800 attack. Ooh, just shy. Oh, but it banishes a card. Just just shy. Wait, what do you mean this is just will, shy? You can just take it out. There. See you later. Well, this is kind of it, though. I mean... I mean, I'm looking at, I'm looking at one card in hand. And I'm not feeling great. Not feeling great. Uh, Maybe Cyber okay. Twin. No, no, no. I'm not paying. I'm not playing around Sphere Creep. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> um, shit, man. Uh, yeah, I guess I gotta set that. Go ahead. Uh oh. How how could this possibly have gone? I know. How, what, I mean, the fucking what the I summon an eight thousand attack guy. That should just mean I win. Unfortunately, um, I knew the draw because of plagues, and uh, let's just say there's a reason that it went to my hand. Oh boy, oh boy! Why did all that right, guy gain ahead. attack points? Oh, uh, he he turns all Sidras. Yeah. Okay. okay. I mean, this isn't useless. Okay, let's activate Cyber Rev System. Okay. Now I did notice you didn't summon that guy in the extra monster zone, which is particularly rude. Not really sure yep. why you didn't do that one. Uh, I don't know if you've got him. Oh man, if I, it's not in the, the structure deck, neither one of them are, but uh, man, if I would've went for Cyber Twin, I would've had another Cyber Dragon right here, would've been pretty good, but I'm sure it's fine. Doesn't this do something, target one? Yeah, okay, we're gonna go for this. We're just gonna have to hope you don't have anything. Um, let's activate um, Cyber Dragon. I. Oh wait, doesn't this like of Elgrand? Yeah, yeah. It, okay, yeah, it's, it's it doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter either way. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, no, because there was nothing else I could have uh, gone for there. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. Um. Oh, I. Oh wait, you don't necessarily have game. Yeah, yeah. Let's go next. That's true. Let's go next. Maybe you can't. Maybe you can't break this. I mean. I mean, my other maybe, play was maybe like, I can't bring back maybe hers and then you know just pass on it. So this is like about the same, <laughs> although it would have added oh, a card. Oh boy, we are seeing the stoppable force versus the movable object here today. Yeah, I can't believe my object was move. Oh my god, dude. Okay, what? A, I don't even know what back row's in there. <gasps> Hold! Oh my god, actual best top deck. That's insane. Um, I don't know if it gets anywhere. Let's activate Cyber Dark. Oh Realm. my God! Uh, hold, hold. <laughs> sure. Okay. Okay. Add add from deck to hand. Let's add cannon. That's so annoying. Um, yep. kind of gets there, but I don't know if it. Okay. Let's activate cannon. I don't know if this actually like yep. does anything. Um, let's add this. Oh, that's so frustrating. You only get the um. Oh, you only get the the effect where you can Miracle Fusion if you add the Power Bond, which I don't have a discard for. Okay, okay, maybe I'm fine. Maybe I'm fine. Maybe I'm fine. I mean, you've been fine so far. I've been passing. Oh, yeah, chat, you're totally right. I The set fucked this whole thing up. You know, I was trying to... I was trying to stay in. Yeah, I was trying to make yeah. him think that I got some cool back row. Not that I don't necessarily have a cool back row. And it totally backfired, yes. 
Oh, uh, wait. Wait. That's interesting. Um, you got some combo you're cooking over there? Or? I I might be cooking. I might be chefing just a little bit. Okay. Um, uh, let's go flakes. Oh shit! Isn't there a ten? There, there is. is. You're about to see him. It is Red Eyes Zombie Dragon. Oh shit! What's this guy up to? He's the exactly the same. During your that's opponent's exactly. turn. Okay, that's pretty good. Let me see how I can do this. That's so we'll go Haunted Zombies. What the hell is this? <laughs> I've <laughs> never, never seen, seen this. this card. Banish one zombie. Banish nine tails. Haunted box. token. Wait, that perfectly sets up your Naruto. Wait, did you just banish that for cost? Why the fuck did you do that? Uh, because now I will use Return of the Zombies to banish the token and summon back my Skeleton Dragon Felgram. Whoa. Okay, you're using these cards. And I will use Felgram. Hmm. I will banish your monster. Okay. Yeah, no, I see. And I you hope that it. that is enough. <laughs> Unless. Yeah, yeah, no, you got it. Fuck! I, I had this set was, uh, weird. a bluff power bond, and that ended up fucking me there. Oh That's so no! Sad. I mean, if you had summoned off power bond, you just die, right? Well, yeah, unless I killed you. Although now that we see kind of what you had, but um, okay. Oh my fucking! This is you're gonna you're gonna see my opening play, and you're gonna be like, is this the same deck, dog? Uh, okay. I mean, um, your opening play last time was literally T set pass, so yeah, anything true. is better than that, uh, right? Let's normal summon Unizombie. Oh shit! Yeah, um, this actually Unizombie you... from deck. Uh, yeah. Okay, so this could get you a lot of places. I mean, you got infinite okay. thing. I think Mizuki is in this structure. Pretty sure. Mizuki it is and Gozuki yes. um, and the glow up ball, the and the necro. Were, I mean, yeah, a lot of stuff. What exactly I want to do with my life? I think I'm gonna send Mizuki. Yeah. Uh, and then we'll go, Jackabolin. Discard. Gozuki. Doug could have played around the sphere Kribo by. Well, already that's a bad start to the statement, but. <laughs> By putting two Cyber um, Twin Mizuki. on the board? I don't think that could have happened. I only had one fusion. Coming out Gozuki. Yeah, this is um the Jacko Boole and a card that never really saw a competitive play, but is actually like quite strong. I think it was just released a few oh, years he's... too late. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like unironically quite quite good. Let's go Gozuki. You're gonna send <laughs> We actually have options here. Plagues. Yeah, and you got two cards that send any monster Plagues. from the deck to the graveyard, so Put yeah. this card back on top of the deck. Pretty sure there's no level nine synchro. Let's go. So you got eight or six here. Isn't the six one like the one of the better dragon. ones? Oh yeah. Just this guy's mills. crazy. Oh, it's uh, like um. Sends. Oh shit! It's literally shooting star dragon for zombies. So we want him to become a three. Am I reading that correctly? If we want to go zombie dragon, I think so. So we have to send becomes the difference in the so we have to send a three here right so that he becomes a three God, I, although do i want to do that i also just want to chill on jack of bolin i think i, I um, mean it's omega right talking about zombie yeah it's right to it's right to go in on it i think yeah we'll send vendred hound horde uh then we'll go are are the vendreds in this pack how many cards are yes, in there? Yes, they are. Vendred, white, and all the That's generic it. zombies. That's stuff. actually it. Oh, shit. Okay, no, okay. the generic zombie stuff is really not in there. Oh, okay, fair. Uh, we're going to go Red Eyes Zombie Necro Dragon here. For a 10. Okay. Yikes. You're going to go Vendred Hound Horde. Oh, shit. Okay. It's Vendred Knights. And we are going to make the other Red Eyes Synchro Monster. Because, it, yeah, it's a, this is the old one, right? Or wait. No, no, no. This is the, the old one. The, I mean, not 
really the old one. It's like the old, yeah, the old new one. one the new post, old yeah. one. Okay, so what do we have going on here? You can special zombie. That seems so. We're gonna do that. Okay. And where does this really Bring go? Back Jack of Bolin. Is this even any interruptions? I don't think so. Zombie monster from your grave to your field. Let's find out together. Hmm. This card's in your grave. I mean, that's not an interruption. This isn't an interruption. The Jacko Boolan does get to summon a guy from, but these don't have interruptions. I mean, the Immortal Dragon. Hmm. I don't think you have interruptions. Uh, wait, does this? Right, have am a I going to be killed here? Target. I don't know. Let's activate cards. I'm gonna activate Cyberdark Claw. I'm actually a little surprised that I have a target. Maybe I forgot to take something out of my deck. Oh, oh no. Yeah, I do have this one. Oh shit! Okay. Um. Okay. Let me think about this because there's so many random ass cards in this deck. Because uh, I've played Cyber Darks before and I've played Cyber Dragons before, just never really in combination here. But I, I think we got some stuff cooking. Let's go, Cannon. All right. Let's add Chimera. Okay. What the hell does this card do? Send two dragon or machine set one from your hand and deck. Add one machine from your deck to your hand. What the fuck is this card? Oh, cause it's supposed to be setting up. Hmm. Okay, I see. I see. So let's go activate Cyberdark Realm. So sorry, Cyberdark players. This is uh. <laughs> we are. Watch. We are working with what we got here. I don't know. So that could ta you could tag out. Let's activate Chimera, huh? We are we are doing it. We are doing it, baby. Oh, this only discards. Yeah, yeah, I knew that. I knew that. I knew it only discards spell and traps. Um, oh, okay. oh, okay. Happy to not see that card. Got the power bond. So now I can fuse one time. Uh, send two dragon. Let's just activate this card and see what happens. Um. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this card's like hard to get a grasp on what is going to happen. Right. Like I know, or I knew, I won't say I know. Um, I knew the combo at one point with the, you know, to summon the big unaffected guy, but then it quickly became apparent that that wasn't actually a good combo. So people ended up cutting it. Just like it was a good control deck. Okay. From deck, we're going to send Cyberdark Dragon. We can activate their... I mean, this just seems insane. Like, I, I, I mean, Cyber Dragon players are withholding all these powerful cards that we have access to. Um, oh, yeah. Because now I can go... I mean, I feel like this is getting places. Is but also, like, you have a pretty big field right now. And mm -hmm. I am just clicking whatever's highlighted yellow at the moment. So that, you know... Got that going for me. Okay, we got a couple cards here. Um, Cyber Load Fusion. Scary. Yeah, it's it's pretty good. Um, let's use these two cards for this. I think I'm like over analyzing it. I think that um, I should just be okay. Me just doing a Seeger line. Yeah, yeah. Well, what's it, what does this card do? Uh, I don't know. Not going to read it. Okay, let's go um, Power Bomb. Oh, God. Here we go. So this can... Yeah, let's go... You know, let's go Twin this time. Banish. Banish. Get rid of those two. Summon Twin. Was this supposed Astros. to be pointed? I don't know. I might be dead here. I was kind of hoping that. Oh, this card can't even summon anything. Maybe I shouldn't have put... I, I forgot that this deck not only doesn't have Rampage Dragon, it also doesn't get uh, the original Chimera tech, which is, like, kind of crazy. Oh, I can't activate this card for some reason? Oh, because these aren't... Oh. I've made a critical error. Wait, I might need to use the Seeger. Um, target one machine, 21 versus turn the monster. Oh, God. Um, wait, I've fucked up. I've, I've fucked up a little how bit. How could you have, how could you have fucked up? I think you're fine. Uh, I don't know. 
Does this? I guess I have to do this because it's end of main. This uh, will put it back, to um, 67 or 77. Okay, 77. That's not that's not bad. Um. Yeah, it seems all right. Yeah. Select. Yeah, that does seem all right. You know what? I think I think you're right. Um, base card from your grave. This is at 29. Another zombie. Okay, so I think we hit this one first for 10 million. Okay, yeah, we're good. I always think uh, Seeger, here. with the monster it boosts, is the one that doesn't do damage. But it is actually, sorry, oh, I, I think that hand oh. was way easier than I made it see. <laughs> like, oh my god. <laughs> it's okay. Ended up with All like right, okay. three dead cards in hand. All right, game three, run it. Okay. This is not a great hand. But we have the draw, so. Can't be that bad. On the other hand, um, I'm not doing so hot. Let's just go cannon. Let's get set up a little bit. Mm. <laughs> set up a little bit. I'm not doing chance. so hot. Plays the one card starter. I mean, one card starter or... Uh, oh, it's the entire. I, I guess I'll actually. fucking summon it. I don't know, man. What does it go to? Like twenty-four? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I can't beat that. Go ahead, go ahead. This is not ideal. Unizombie. Um. Uh, okay, that is not what I was hoping for. Um. Let's go. Um. One. Two, okay. Okay. Three. Um. That does make me feel a little better, but not... Yeah, okay, that's actually pretty helpful. Um, could do this. I don't think that really... No, I think we got to push with this first. Let's go normal dry. Yes. Oh, is this why this... Does this work? It probably does. Because it's... Yeah, that's, oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, that's kind of yeah, yeah. interesting. I like it. We got something um, going on. Yeah, it's that's definitely a play that you can make. Okay. <laughs> Just make this as a guy. Sure, why not? It has an effect. Let's go Cyber Dragon Nova. Oh, j this card's great. Yeah, it's it's fine. I think it um it definitely does things. Let's see what this face down is. No pyramid turtle. Ooh, so happy to see that. Are uh, you fucking kidding me? <laughs> are you kidding me, dude? <laughs> Why are there? Oh, okay. There just shouldn't be 2100 defense mode monsters. I don't know. Um, I think there is no other choice other than. That's actually pretty good though. That's that's fairly strong. Yeah, that's insane. Yeah. Um. Okay. Add this. Yeah. That's that's good. Let's take it out. It's just like every life point counts. Oh god, what did you have? Every life point counts, so it's a little scary. Um, touch one. Oh, and now I have a cyber dragon in grave, which can be revived. Okay, okay. That's Let's true. Get rid of you know this, and then revive. Maybe even just pass with that. I guess I could make this to have. What is this banish from? Face up. Ah, uh, you're good. I think you're fine. I think that's what I got. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, that is a good card, but I don't think it is going to be enough. Oh, okay. Let's normal summon Vendred Revenants. Uh, what does this one do? If this card is destroyed by card effect? Sure. Yep. Ah, I had so much hope for these Vendred cards. I think everyone did, but... Yeah. And, you know, it's really unfortunate. Like, um, sometimes you see people doing combos with them, and you get the sense that, like, yeah, they really were just, like, one card away. Their yeah. Pote legacy support is actually, like, insanely good, but just came out in Pote, so... What deck was, um... Wasn't there... Wasn't it Drytron that was using some of those new cards to, like, do wacky combos? Battlelord. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Battle Battlelord Lord is almost Ben 10. Um, you're about to end your turn. Let's hit you with a little overflow. Oh, This card has on, fucked me up in so many regional runs. Uh, it's just insane. <laughs> 
Um, and if might just uh, be dead here. Nope, we're good with that. So let's go banish. No, 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 we'll keep that one good. Banish, banish. Pop, pop. Uh, oh, haunted zombies again. Haunted zombies. Vendra charge. Someone zombie from your hand face the field to the. Okay, okay. Not bad. Oh, that's that's pretty good. Yeah, I'll take that. Ooh, too many too many options here. Too many options. I don't know if that's true. Okay, let's go. Uh, yeah, I think you're just dead here. Let's go Chimera. No. Should be. Oh, I really am dead. Follow yeah, me. you know, I think the thing about. Uh... Uh, quick effect. I think the thing about sealed environments is that any deck that has the uh, potential to OTK is just automatically so crazy leagues ahead of the other things. Um, nope, that doesn't need to be done. I, I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just clicking buttons to make sure I have enough. Yeah, yeah. On board, you know. If cyber dragons, if it's yellow, I'm gonna click it basically. Um, let me just go this. I guess I could have made Seeger. Yep. It doesn't matter. We're just although. Although, I should probably play around, um, oh, that would have been better than... A Sphere Karibo, yeah. I should have Karibu. played around the Sphere Karibo. I should have made the, uh, can I just back out of activating Power Bond? No, I can't. Okay, well, uh, you know, I tried. <laughs> um, well, maybe I could still... Because Sphere Karibo... Yeah, Sphere Karibo outs Cyber Twin regardless. So it's not like yeah. that's actually any better. But we oh, will go. Jesus. Okay, what am I doing here? Cyber and I, I don't know, man. I, I think I'm just. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Well, but... this was a fun one. Yeah, this is really this good. This is really one. this is a no. absolute classic. Zane versus zombie. Oh God, I'm getting, I'm getting one shot. I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't know. It's just uh, attack. See if you got. Okay, you don't have the sphere, Karibo, this time. <laughs> Hit you with the. Doug, oh. you uh, you should have played around Sphere Karibo. <laughs> <laughs> How can you do Holy this to moly. me, man? Holy moly, dude! Oh fuck! How can you do this to me? <laughs> <sighs> How could this happen? To me? Um. Okay. So now this can't uh, do any. Damage. That's kind of unfortunate. Um, what does this guy mm. do? Banish from the Cyber Dragon from your hand or face up. Does this count as Cyber Dragon? Okay, I see. So I think we hit this. 21. Um, oh, look, at, look um, at that trigger. Yeah, uh, Revenants, actually. Oh, itself. Ooh. It just brings itself back. <laughs> That's just, not good. It chills, yeah. Um, okay, well, let's just hit this. Let's activate... Nope, not that. Nope, not that. Activate this. <laughs> oh my god, dude! I can't believe you're yeah. fucking Sphere Kribo. Um. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Let's let's send her. It's. I don't think we activated that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, uh, let's add. Uh, um, sure. Deck or grave. Let's just add this from deck. That's fine. Hit that. I mean, do we hit you for? Yeah, probably. You know, just. Oh my god. Do I banish the Seeger during the battle phase? Target machine. I, I think I'm going to keep the Seeger on board. We'll just try to hit for it. What could you possibly have? It's a. Uh, it, it's it's haunted zombies. I am going to. Oh, there's a I graveyard effect? Zombies. You can shuffle one of your banish yeah. if you set this card. Oh. It resets it. It's it's oh. not anything relevant. Um, It seems like it could be relevant, actually. Um. <laughs> Uh, you know what actually might be relevant is Tragodia. Okay. All right. I need a I need a ten star zombie to right take, now. Yeah. Um, a ten star zombie clears this game up. I mean, this is kind of funny. I don't think that really does anything though. I mean, do I really care if you have Tragodia? I don't think so. <laughs> Probably not. I'm All gonna right, be honest. Man. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Here we go. Okay. So only take four thousand. No problem. No problem. Okay, you're up to 12. Okay. Um, Chat, if I had a hand, maybe I would, but no, no. <laughs> Ooh, this is, this is a toughie. I'm not going to lie. This is a toughie. 
Let's go Tragoedia. Ten? I'm gonna send Rev. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, but that's pretty, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Um, okay, do dragons? I yeah. get to activate cannon? Because that would really help help things out here. No, no, it's me. It's me. Ooh. During damage calculation, okay. if the monster equipped with this card battles, you can summon. No, no, no. I I activate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, That'd be kind of sick, though. That would actually be insane in your deck. Uh, so I think I got a little lucky there. So haunted zombies. Yep. We've got banish. four monsters now. That's pretty strong. Hound horde. With two tokens. Mm -hmm. Is the background of the haunted token, is that soul absorbing bone tower? Is that what it's supposed to be? It doesn't, uh, maybe it doesn't have skulls on it. I think it. so. It's like the zombie world. Okay. Okay. And we're going to normal summon. Hopefully not plague spreader. Exactly. Oh, tribute, tribute, Jack of Blue Line. Tribute, Jack of no, Blue. No, I think, I think you got it. Oh my God, this fear, oh. Karibo. <laughs> I don't have, uh, I don't have any tuner access, unfortunately. Okay, okay, that's, jeez. Oh my God, dude. Okay, that's fair. Well, let's see, let's see if I get to get to do anything do silly. This. Um, yeah, take it out. Twelve hundred. Activate this. Would have been funny though. Yep. Would have been funny. <laughs> oh my god, dude! Jeez. You and your fucking you had, you had, <laughs> Tragodia and Sphere Karibo. Yeah, but that was the whole hand. No, <laughs> I'm not saying like just you know right here right now. I'm just saying in general. Like that's crazy that you yeah, had yeah. that. Um, all right, yeah, yeah. Go out oh, on your own terms. Man. I respect it. Yeah, yeah. Holy shit, man. I think I probably could have played around at that second game, but I, I just didn't even think that you'd draw it twice. Oh, man. I was I was thinking to myself, I'm like, you know, I think I do have hand or uh, draws that wouldn't be the game here, but no. Nah. Yeah. So it's um, unfortunately, it is it is a little middling, as you may have guessed. The pack doesn't really have the generic good stuff. Uh, oh, I this pulled is not a lot of a second ups. Unizombie. Yeah, second Unizombie, which was cool. Second Jack of Bolin, which was cool. Um, but, like, the rest of the pack really is, like, Vendred stuff. And then at high rarity, uh, Zombie World Baylor Drock. And so I pulled Zombie World. I got that beautiful Royal, but I didn't I didn't pull any Baylor Drock. So there's no real reason to use it. Yeah, it's a, it's a pretty... I mean, it would have kind of fucked me up. Like, setup. all my machine stuff. Having Zombie World? Yeah, yeah. I am curious. I think a Man, number of them. Three some of them the do Vendor. say machine, but some don't. Some, yeah, some it's of them I do. I pulled three Battle Lord. I was so excited. Three but, Battle Lord, three uh, Ritual spell. Then draw them. If you're not cheating the ritual limit, it's actually really bad to play ritual cards. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that that is kind of how it turns what do, out. What do you got? Let me pull up. Twitch. Um, yeah, I mean, my deck is. Uh, I I did not pull oh, any insane. high rarity cards. It's basically just the structure deck plus oh. low rarity. I think I pull. I have it's like actually not insane at all. Five cyber twins. We don't have rampage. We don't have chimera tech. Um, overload dragon. We don't have infinity. Yeah, we basically pulled nothing from the pack. But the thing about this archetype is that all the low rarity cards you know the power bonds even the they're just know, materials for cyber end they're yeah. just very very strong in a sealed environment but um see you guys next week we'll see what structure deck shuffling happens might get some cool ones peace Ten packs, except I can't afford them.